everyone. Thank you so much for joining me today for another video. I'm going to be working on this pre-used, as you can see, <laughs> 10 by 20 inch canvas. And I'm going to do just a traveling cup, um, straight pour, using black as my base. So, I need to be able to cover up this green. I didn't like it. Obviously, you can tell I scraped it. It is smooth. I made sure that it was smooth. Um, didn't want any lumps. So, I am going to go ahead and put down just a little bit of black just to kind of get my canvas coated. Now, I don't need to cover the whole thing yet because I am going to be tilting this out. And I've got some colors that I've used in previous pours. And, um... They're beautiful colors. So I just wanted to go ahead, there's not much, just use them up a little bit. All right. All right, just blow this out a little bit. And my paints are a little bit thicker. I'm just using my hair dryer just because. Makes it a little bit easier. Like I said, I don't need to cover the whole canvas right now. You can tell my paints are thicker. I'm gonna use my torch. Get those air bubbles out. Hopefully my new smaller torch will come in soon. I've got it off, it just takes it a while. All right, here's my cup. The colors that I'm gonna be using, I've got some gold. This is a color that I made. It is pewter, and it's got some Payne's gray, and it's really a pretty color. This is almost a plum color. It's um, Alizarian Crimson Hue, and I've put some black in it to deepen it. And then I've got a bronze here. I also have some Quinacridone uh, Nickel Azo Gold. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it. And I also have some white. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start. You know, I think I am gonna put white. I debated on it, but we're gonna go for it. Just white. I don't wanna put the red next to it. Blue. Should we add the nickel as our gold? Hmm, let's do the bronze. Bronze. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> Chicken out. And these are dark colors. So we'll have to see how this one dries. And this is the gold. Do another little. This should be plenty, but I'm gonna go ahead and do one more little layer. White. Blue. I'm calling it blue. It's more pewter with some colors in it. Uh, bronze. Lost my train of thought there. Bronze. And gold. All right, that is pretty, pretty. Okay, I'm just gonna kinda go down the middle of my, should I go down the middle or try to off-center it? Hmm. We're gonna go, I think, just down the center. And I'm just gonna go like this. There's probably going to be enough for me to come back through it. Just a little bit. There we go. Sorry, I'm having to concentrate here. Okay, I've got a little bit left. I'm, I think I'm gonna leave it alone. All right, I'm gonna pop the air bubbles in that, and then we'll stretch it out.
love this. Love this. Let me think here. God, that red is beautiful. I mean, it is beautiful. Okay, we're going to do another one. Uh, a little bit of white. Move it over here. Blue. Red. Love that red. Bronze. I actually think I was supposed to do the gold before the red, but that's okay. Here we go. White. If you're not happy with it, keep going. Blue. Red. There we go. I think I got the color combination correct that time. <laughs> and the gold. Yep. There we go. Okay. Yeah, some parts are super cool, and then other parts I'm just not wild about. So we are going to do this again. Here we go. out again. And I think I'm going to go, whoops, no, I don't want to do that. Wow, look at the blue cells that came up. Go that side. That side. I'm just going back and forth, stretching out that middle. going to go even further this time. Oops, keep turning it around so you can see it. One more little, there we go. And back that way. That's super cool. I'm going to add some black down here. Didn't mean to add quite that much. <laughs> so that it will flow better. There we go. Okay. Trying to get these off right here. All right, I'm gonna bring this back to the middle. Y'all, I think that is so cool. <laughs> oh, I like that. I'm glad I decided to do this second. Second cut made all the difference in the world. Love it. Okay, I am leaving that alone. I think that is really cool. Got black on the corner. Yep, I just love it. It's really pretty. I'm going to bring you down for a close-up. Okay, here is the overall piece. I think it turned out amazing. So glad I did that second cup. First one just wasn't working, so I decided to do it again. But it is beautiful. You see all the shine and sparkle. It's so pretty. Just interesting. All the colors work really well together. Almost looks like flames. 
I think that's really pretty in the middle. It's blue. Look at all those cells. It's really pretty. Okay, my lights are out and you can see all the shine. It's just beautiful. It really is beautiful. Look at all those cells. This by itself almost looks like a wood grain. The whole piece just looks really good. That look, that by itself looks like flames. <laughs> I'm finding all kinds of things in this painting. It's just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. As you can see all the shimmer. Let me, let me show it to you this way completely 100% to me. It looks like the sun and I don't know. Here's a little bit of a shadow. Sorry. <laughs> My fingers are so better. Here is the water and then this is the reflection of the sun. I just think it's gorgeous. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. And as always, you have a great day. Until next time, bye.